two. <clears throat> okay, what's up, guys? Uh, we're, hey, what's we're up? We're here, and we're talking about this ridiculously good camera that Canon has uh, released. I know we're a little late on our... We've been, talk- we've been talking trash about Canon for a long time, but this camera looks good. I mean, it- like, I'm afraid about Fuji coming, coming back from from something from a release like this i'm not sure what fuji can do to answer this but okay so it it is the new eos rp a uh cheap version of their new rf system um it starts at 1300 dollars for just the body um 1300 bucks 13 that's the same price as the uh as the xc3 right yeah well yeah, but it it's full frame, so that's better already. It's full frame, dude. I know. I can't. It's, I don't know how they got the price so cheap, but it's full frame. It's got the uh, the swivel screen. They got rid of that stupid touch bar thing that they had on the on the other camera. They are. <laughs> they are. <laughs> it's not there. Look. Yeah, they got rid of it. So <laughs> they are. I'm sorry. <laughs> Come on, man. We were supposed to. <laughs> all right. I, I just didn't know. All right, guys. We were... Oh, sorry. I just didn't. I just didn't know. I just didn't know they already got rid of the touch. We mark. were uh, trying to be um, nice about this. I'm camera, sorry. And Mike already destroyed <laughs> the entire bit. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So it looks like they got rid of the uh, the touch bar. At the I just top. needed to. I needed to look. I needed to know that beforehand. <laughs> I too. should have told you prior. <laughs> <laughs> they already one generation later, and they went that. Nah, get it? We're out. Okay, so I'm not sure what this camera is. I know it's the bargain, the bargain version. It's 26 megapixels. The R, the there was the R like extra or whatever that was like 50 megapixels, right? And then the one. The one that released with that was 24 megapixels as well, or? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, so I'm not sure what the difference is. Um, super fast and accurate autofocus. It has 4K video, but apparently uh, the dual pixel autofocus system doesn't work when you shoot in 4K, which is... <laughs> <laughs> Mike, <laughs> I'm talking. <laughs> They're just... <laughs> I'm not Daryl Daryl is just <laughs> what? They're just gimping it so that the R doesn't look like shit. <laughs> Maybe it, they're like, well, if you buy the R instead of the RP, then you can get this stuff. Um So the R is 30 megapixels. Okay, so the R is 30 and then the other one, the R extra, what is it called? RS R uh, Okay. Yeah, 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 whatever yeah, yeah. it is. Um, you can put all the RF lenses on it, guys. Can you believe it? Yeah? <laughs> you can or you can't? You can. The world's can. lightest and smallest full-frame DSLR with the world's largest, most humongous lenses attached to it. Um, let's see... Oh god. They should just make it. They should just put the whole camera in the lens. <laughs> of course. So you're just holding the lens like a telescope. It says to be just... the revolution again on here. Oh, they got rid of the uh they got rid of the um the top screen as well. Really? Mm. Mm. That's a bad move. I love that thing. Yeah, that that's gone. That's gone. They've kept the stupid on off uh switch on the left there, I see. Uh, let's see. And a game changing RF oh. lens mount at the heart of all of it all. Don't worry. The LS, the LCD and viewfinder resolutions are halved. <laughs> They're half <laughs> what the RPs was, but they still got that Canon glass, that special crystal. Oh yeah. The Canon crystal is, I'm sure the viewfinder is the same, right? It's gotta be. Yeah. They wouldn't. I mean, it's one million. No, it's one million. It's two million dots as opposed to three and a half million dots. Is that true? It is. Yeah, true. dude. God. It's half the resolution, dude. Um, it 
Also, apparently, it doesn't shoot 1080p at 24 frames for anyone looking for that cinematic look. It's a great, it's a great move. Great move. <laughs> Why? It obviously can do it. It can handle it. Why would you just not have that? No, it can't. They would never just take it away. Well, what, but it does it in 4K. Yeah, but you wouldn't just take away 1080p at 24 frames. I mean, come on. It's way, it's way smaller than the R. <laughs> Is it way smaller? Hit me with a link. Yeah, Hit me with a link. Hit me with a link. It's shorter. It's shorter and and less less wide. wide. Um, oh, it's got yeah. a it's got forty thousand ISO guys. So that's cool. Mm, that's it. That's <laughs> <laughs> can't wait to use that forty thousand ISO. You know. Oh, I see. You're looking at the comparisons here. Yeah, I got all the comparisons. Nice. There. Uh Max Shutter 4000th instead of 8000. Uh, I do like the size. No no Ibis still. No, no Ibis. Uh, no internal body stabilization, guys. So, sorry. Minimal sealing for weather sealed body. Minimal. <laughs> Minimal. <laughs> Couple drops. That's... Couple drops, it's fine. It'll be okay. Uh, Don't put it under a waterfall, though. Oh, oh, it does have one thing better. It's not a 1.7 crop anymore, guys, for 4K. Mm. It's a 1.6. What is it? Ooh, they gave you a little <laughs> bit of room. A little bit of room. You're gonna be shooting a lot of four. You're gonna be shooting a lot of 4K because you can't shoot 24P if you don't. Yeah. So. so enjoy those large file sizes for all that shit that you don't want to shoot in 4K. It's not that much Sorry. smaller or bigger though. It really. It looks kind of weird. It's definitely thinner, huh? Yeah, it's thinner and it's and it's shorter. Oh, it's like. It's just that that top part makes it look really short. Well, the well the, the bottom EVF too. Is, look the, the oh, it's not. The lens oh, it's mount. not. Okay, I see. I see. It's not a. Uh, the lens mount's shifted down. Yeah, can anyone explain what the uh, what the purpose of this camera is? I'm I'm not really sure. Is it just for e entry level uh, Canon mirrorless users? I, I just can't, I mean, I guess full frame is the only reason you would get this over the X-T3, because the X-T3 is the same price, and you get so many more features. Like, so many more features. Well, there's one feature you wouldn't be getting. The full frame. <laughs> this is good. I like this website you found. Uh, the EOS R gets 560 shots per charge, and the, uh, the EOS RP gets 270. Wow. Oh, damn. That's a lot of photos. That's a lot. <laughs> I know everyone talks shit about those Fujifilm batteries, which are pretty much the most, the probably the worst thing about the Fujis is probably batteries. Even though I don't, I, yeah, I yeah, don't, definitely. I don't get the idea of not carrying that many, but um, this one's 270 guys, and this is a Canon size battery. So I'm not, I'm not exactly sure. Uh, why is it so low? I'm not sure. I have no idea. It has to be the same battery, right? They wouldn't do. They wouldn't do that, or would they? Also, it has the max buffer capacity is unlimited. Okay. It's and it's 47 with the with the R. That's weird. Hmm. It's so weird, man. It's like it's like a different bunch of people made this camera. <laughs> they just made like a. They just made like a different camera. <laughs> <laughs> like slightly like a slightly different camera oh man yeah look it can do t it can do 60 fps 60 fps at 1080 but it can't do 20 that's such a weird if anyone can explain that to us please we i i, I think did they forget did they forget to put it in you're telling me they forgot <laughs> i can't i can't come up with a better explanation <laughs> I, I'm bang okay. I'm put, I put five dollars on. They forgot that they forgot. Okay, five dollars. We'll I think out. they just. I think they just forgot. And then the first firmware, they'll go. Eh, we sorry. We meant to. We meant to put some twenty four p on the ten eighty. Yeah. Do uh does is Canon gonna be releasing firmware updates for their mirrorless cameras? 
Uh, they can't release. They can't release a firmware update for that minimal ceiling. That's for sure. <laughs> oh God! Min- An- minimal. Another. Minimal. An- Another fail from Canon, in my opinion. I'm not really sure. I mean, I guess if you really wanted Canon and you know you want to spend thirteen hundred bucks, all right, pretty good price. Um, yeah, I, but you would be. This camera is garbage. It's just not a. It's not a good camera. I mean, maybe not. So, maybe not for us. Maybe for. Why do they keep flopping? I get yeah you must you have a very specific scenario in which maybe uh, you need full full frame full frame or bust I guess would be really the person the who buys dad this. who is just like I know I want a Canon I know I want full frame but I don't know why I know I want full frame and I know I want minimal ceiling and my so and my it. wife heard me say it so she's gonna get it for me for Christmas and it's gonna cost it is sick what's that. It's significantly lighter. It's uh, 485 grams as opposed to 660. So, <sighs> Canon, Canon, Canon. What does that mean? I don't I'm know. not sure. Uh, we have a video coming out for the X-T30, which we think is a good second body to have if you're in the Fuji film uh, realm. I think... Uh, it's actually a pretty good first body. Even it's a know, great I- first body, and it's definitely a better choice than this piece of shit that Canon has released at $900. Yeah, so, you save money and you get way more. And you can get any Fujicron lens at whatever focal length you want to start with for the price of this body alone. And you want to talk about f- full frame, they make Fuji to EF autofocus adapters if you really really want to do full frame, just get and have EF lenses, just get an adapter. You'll put <laughs> your back to full frame. <laughs> there's Met- one metabones. there's one review on the and it's got one star we gotta oh, amazing. read this what does it say let's what does read it say? this let's go yeah i can't wait to read this uh oh my god it's blacked out i can't even click it canon canon it, it, dude conspiracy conspiracy look i canon can't won't let you it. read it's got one canon star won't let you read the one review what the fuck <laughs> Is this camera weather soon? We caught you, Canon. We caught you. Our EF and Tamra lenses fully. S- yeah. Also, if you want to purchase a EF or EFS lens, you're gonna have to purchase an adapter. So um, you're gonna have to start. This one with- doesn't. This one doesn't come with an. Does it come with a kit lens? For thirteen, or is it just the body? Fucking yeah, right, dude. It's it's fucking two thousand with the kit lens right here. Ugh. Twenty-two hundred. Just get a just get just get a regular can. But just get a good camera. What are you doing? Twenty-two hundred. Two- actually, and it what? there's there's some savings. It's actually twenty-four hundred with the kit lens. Wait, wait, wait. How, how much is the Panasonic? The new that stupid new Panasonic full frame. Is if you the, really want full frame. Is it the SLI or the SL1? <laughs> the S1 or whatever. <laughs> oh, S1, S1. Pan, oh, 20, 2500 bucks. I guess it's 35 What's the cheaper version? Because there's the S1 and there's the cheaper one. S1R. No, you know, that's the more expensive. Jesus Christ. The S1R is $5,000. <laughs> 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 oh god holy shit never mind listen guys um, these camera companies are banking on these stay-at-home dads or stay-at-home dads whatever these people with money to purchase these god awfully expensive cameras um it's the full frame don't fall for the full frame conspiracy guys do not fall for it um I mean, at five thousand bucks, you know what I'm, you know what I'm getting at forty six hundred bucks with a lens, bro. Not guys. I know we all we have all male subscribers, but I meant guys <laughs> and girls. When I say guys, I mean people, the humanity of a human, human person. Um, Humans. Yeah, I don't know, guys. If <laughs> girls and guys, if you're spending five thousand bucks on your first camera, something is wrong with you. Okay, go <laughs> go do some more research. There's there's other options. Uh, I think so, like, I think that's it. Uh, Thirteen hundred bucks. At the, is this the, is this kit lens the cheapest RF lens? I I, I just I I don't know. I... Oh oh wait a second. Okay, the EF EOS 
uh, adapter does come with this. With the kit. <laughs> is that lens an EF lens? That. Wait, is it? No, no, no. It's an RF lens. Okay. All right. But it, com- but it comes. But it comes with an adapter in the kit. Yeah, because. Oh, God, I don't know what Canon's doing, guys. I can't even look. I don't know what the cheapest RF lens is. Um, it doesn't make any sense but, to me. None of this makes any sense to me. Okay, That's here fine. we go. RF 35 1.8. So 500 bucks for your cheapest, your cheapest, your cheapest lens. And then uh, your second lens is going to be um, over 2,000 bucks after that. So <clears throat> if you want full frame, if you want it sort of cheap. Go for it. Um, there's there's plenty of other options at this price point. If you uh, guys like the EOS RP, please drop a comment. Tell us why. Tell us why. I want to know. I have no... there. There's nothing in me that would ever, ever consider this camera. Ever. So... Uh, I think that's it, Mike. You have any? Is there anything else you want to say about this thing? Nope. End it. No? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Click the dislike. <laughs> Click the unsubscribe. <laughs> 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 <laughs>